Hello, how are you? This is a page for Coco Daisy made with the November Snow Globe kit. And I have the 12 by 12 memory keeping kit and I have the pocket pages kit. And what I'm creating today is a starburst pattern for a page in my December daily album from last year. And the size I use generally is six by eight and that's what I'm using here. So what I did was I first cut out the different triangles and fitted them together on a piece of scratch paper. And I even actually like glued them down. And then I just trimmed all around the edges to be not exactly six by eight, but like something like five and a half by seven and a half so that it would have a border. And now I am adding stars, not stars, snowflakes to my page. And I'm gonna just add them to my scratch page first and fit them where I like them. And the type of adhesive I'm using is, for these guys, is a vellum adhesive because it, it doesn't have those little dots that my other rolling adhesive does, so it basically doesn't show for stuff like this, which is not entirely transparent, but it's translucent. So now that it's on my scratch paper, and because it's scratch paper, I can just cut, cut through the paper itself. And I am cutting out this large triangle of my starburst pattern. And now I'm just trimming off the sides and I love when things with shapes go all the way to the edge. That's one of my favorite design things. Although it's a sort of a created edge because it's all, it's not going to the very edge of the paper. It's going to the edge that I made with the border. So I just peeled those off of the notebook paper with the adhesive still on them and glued them onto the cardstock. And in that triangle there, I am adding some plastic snowflakes. Cute, right? I just have to figure out how they all fit. I initially did know where they all would go so that they would fit in that size. But here I am reinventing the wheel because <laughs> I couldn't remember. But my page was actually one little, one medium, and one medium on top. There we go. Now you can see it perfect. Now they fit. And I'm not putting them all the way to the middle because I'm actually putting something else in the middle. And that, doing that made actually this page a lot easier because as you can see, my triangles do not <laughs> line up perfectly with the middle of this page. Although I did try to line them up pretty nicely with the edge of the page. Now I am unpeeling the snowflakes and sticking them down. Aren't these gorgeous? They're like a little bit shimmery. I don't know if you can tell in the video, but they have a really nice sheen to them. And I think they're just like a really pretty design. And then the last corner, the last triangle, I added some, some of that glittery sequin mix that was in the kit. 
And what I actually did was I placed them down. Yeah, and then this is the, the die cut that I put in the middle there. And then after I placed those down, I actually put clear glue on top and they just sort of dried in place and it was perfect. Thanks for watching.